Community Focus on GTV2 Lima. Thanks for joining us today on Community Focus. I'm Ann Decker. I'm pleased to welcome to the studio today Sergeant Paula Strickler with the Lima Police Department and Shelley Snyder. They are part of the Building Partnerships Initiative, which has just created a new communications booklet. Good morning. Thanks for being here. Good morning. What is the Building Partnerships Initiative? Well, basically, the Building Partnerships Initiative, it is a multidisciplinary approach. Um, it has cooperation between law enforcement, prosecution, and social service agencies to address crimes committed against persons with disabilities. Okay. And you've created this booklet, which I don't know if you can see it really well, but it's got all kinds of little pictures in here of body parts and weather conditions and items and objects and days of the week. And what's the point of all this? A lot of times we end up talking with people that are, have a disability or they're having difficulty communicating with us due to the trauma of a crime that's committed against them or that they've witnessed. Um, the book was put together so we could maybe communicate with those folks um, by no, nothing more than pointing to different pictures that are included in the, in the booklet there. So like, please call my pastor. I mean, there's a picture of a pastor in there yes. or a neighbor or a worker. And um, I mean, really, you've got the Caucasian, African American, Latino that can point to a perpetrator, basically. Yes. yes. And help that that gives you help to track down. Again, what's if they're going not on. able to talk with us, mm -hmm. this will allow us a way to to gather the information that we need to conduct our investigations. Um, if it becomes time to go to court to testify, we can take this along and say, you know, this is how we did our investigation. We've got that. We can take the booklet. It's obviously small, transportable for us. That we can take it and show it in court. I would also think not just for persons with disabilities, but maybe those who don't speak English, or right. if you're dealing with children, I'd imagine it would be a help there as well. Yes, yes. And the back, it also includes um, black and white copies mm -hmm. and the zippered part that um, law enforcement officers can then mark what the individual is saying and attach that to the police report also, so they can have accurate record of what the individual what a great idea. is communicating. Now, you're Lima Police, but this isn't restricted just to the police department. No. Um, again, it's, it's some that's portable um, through a grant um, that the uh, partnership had. We were able to put one of these at every cruiser in Allen County for all law enforcement agencies, not just the police department, but the sheriff's department, and then the smaller agencies surrounding um, in Allen County so that everybody has access to these. And do you see that expanding at some point to fire departments or like children's services or some of the other agencies in the community? We would love to expand. Um, we do also have a partnership in Putnam County, so they also have enough of those booklets for all of their um, law enforcement officers, and we provided five copies to Hardin County. Um, I work for the Allen County Board of Developmental Disabilities, so I also have one, and I um, do civil investigations there at the county board, so that would be very helpful for us as well. Wonderful. If there is any agency out there that's watching that is, thinks it could benefit from one of these books, would you pass them out to these people? This is the beginning stage, and um, that's something we would like to do eventually. We had to figure out the best way to do it. There is a cost, and our grant did end in September of 2010. Mm -hmm. So we have to figure out the financial aspect of that in okay. order to get more made. Okay. But if there is a demand, I'd imagine you want people to yes. contact you anyway, and you can assess it at that point? Exactly. But, but the neat thing is we have those pictures. Mm -hmm. We can change the booklets to fit. If we decide that we're missing something, we can always change the books and add that to our books. Have you had a so. chance to use it yet? Not yet. Waiting for the day we get to, though. <laughs> okay. Anything else we need to know about these communication books? Well, I don't no. think so. Okay. Well, let's hope that everybody out there watching never has an opportunity to use it. There you go. But it is a, a really wonderful idea, and kudos to you for putting it together. Thanks Thank for you. coming in today. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Shelley Snyder and Paula Strickler. I'm Ann Decker.